Man, I've had a lot of gas for a while now. Gear acquisition syndrome. Went to the doctor. He couldn't find the cure. But I think I just found out what it is. The DJI Action 2 camera. Let's check it out. Okay, so the DJI Action 2. This little camera right here is pretty cool stuff. You get the camera on the front, you got your viewfinder on the back, it's waterproof. Okay, so you can take it out, you can splash it around, you can put it in a cup of water, drink that if you want to, and it's gonna do some cool stuff. So, took this out, had it down by the lake, had the waves coming out, it was pretty cool stuff. There's two different models of it. There's one that has an actual camera that's on the front of it, so that basically if you're doing vlogging and whatnot, you can see yourself, and it has a battery in it as well to give you some more time, as well as uh, you can charge it with the USB-C here, as well as you can put a memory card in the back, okay? So it's a nice little uh, feature, and of course you need that, one of the modules basically to charge the main camera as well, okay? And they just clip together, and you're good to go. Now this one here with the second monitor comes with uh, a magnetic connector that you can put on a tripod or selfie stick. You have a magnetic clip that you can put on to like a GoPro uh, stick or a DJI stick. And then you have a lanyard as well as uh, a stationary part that you can stick on something and that'll work as well, okay? So that's the first one. Okay, I really like this one. It's pretty cool because you've got the dual screens. Then you also have the same thing, right? Where it's, you have the DJI Action 2 and there's a battery pack. This will give you substantial battery pack time. Um, it also charges uh, the thing as well as has the SD slot in the back, connects together. This one here comes with just the lanyard and this connector to put on a basically uh, a GoPro stick or something along those lines, okay? Very cool stuff, I've been playing around with them. Some footage here that you can check out. The reason why I like these is they've also got built-in mics. You have one mic, I believe it is, in this one here on its own. And uh, when you have the actual one with the screens, it gives you four mics. So it's pretty clear and uh, gives you some pretty good audio and gives you a lot of different versatility because of the fact that the form factor is so small, which is why I really like these things. It gives you so much creativity when you're on the go and you want to play around with stuff. So it's so small, so compact. Great little piece of tech. Um, there was some overheating problems, but they now have this case that goes around it that you can get for it. And that's supposed to dissipate the heat. So basically you get better uh, recording time, okay? So a nice piece of tech. I enjoyed it a lot. Uh, I got both models only because after getting one with just the battery, I thought the second model with the screen would be very good. Plus I've got the options kind of interchange them out. And uh, nobody talks about the extra stuff you get with the uh, camera module, which was pretty nice to be able to basically put that onto a tripod and use it in many different ways. Um, the uh, pieces on their own are a little bit expensive, but if you can get them with the kit, you're saving yourself some money. So just consider that when you're purchasing it. Okay, so the DJI Action 2 camera on its own will get you 70 minutes of recording time with the battery module you will get 180 minutes of recording time. And with the monitor 
module, you will get 160 minutes of time, okay? That's a lot of time. These also have touch screens on here, as well as the uh, front monitor module also has a touch screen. You can use the DJI MIMO app to basically take files off and uh, download them, and uh, you can find that on the App Store as well as on Google Play. But overall, I like this and uh, thought it was a good piece of gear. It's very versatile and good for when you're on the go. And uh, if you're traveling a lot, it might be an option that you might want to consider just because it's so small, you can fit in your pocket, take it wherever you want to go, and you can vlog wherever you want to go. It's not as big as a camera, so it's something to consider. Okay, one other thing that I forgot to say was that these things are magnetic. So you can basically stick this on anything magnetic, it'll stick there. The magnets are very strong. And these clicking together, they lock in. The same thing with the magnetic parts that you get with it. Click it in, make sure it's nice and snug. This isn't going anywhere, okay? So very cool. So just something to think about when you're uh, thinking of getting a camera. Now I've also put protective covers on them as well because people were complaining that the glass breaks fairly easy, but with these protective pieces around it, you should be good to go. But uh, all in all, great piece of tech like it a lot and thanks for watching this video just to let you know that uh, this is not a sponsored video I happen to be looking at a lot of different gear trying to find the gear that would work perfectly for my situation and this is what I've come up with all right thank you very much and you have a great day